Welcome to the first of many accessibility tips for elementary students on the iPad. In this first video, we're going to look at the most basic tool to use, and that is enabling the accessibility features in your control center. This is going to give you quick and easy access to all the amazing tips you're going to learn this year. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to open up your gray settings app with the gear. On the left side, you're going to scroll down until you see Control Center. Up top, you have your included controls, so you can keep those the same. Um, if you choose to add any or take some away, you just tap on the red minus button or the green plus button. But for this time, we're going to add in our accessibility shortcuts by clicking the green plus next to the accessibility right here, the top one. That's going to add it in. You can rearrange it by selecting on the right side and move it up. The two most used for me are the screen recording and accessibility shortcuts. Now I can hit my home button one time and I'm going to swipe from the top right corner where you see the percentage it down towards the middle of my screen to access my control center. Now I can tap on accessibility right there and I get my options that I currently have. I use assistive touch all the time, so I'm gonna turn that back on, and when I click out of this, I should see my accessibility shortcut. Let me turn that off and back on, there it is. And now I can use that as a pointer. Throughout the year, I'm going to show you how you can add some different accessibility features, what they do, starting in two weeks, we're going to learn about text-to-speech and the text-to-speech option on the iPad, how we can enable that, but we'll always look back to that accessibility shortcuts and seeing how we can put things in there to make our lives easier.